Hello everyone, my name is Juan and welcome to this week's video. Today I will talk to you guys about types of people during exams. I understand that during exams we're all stressed out, um, we've been studying a lot, and there's just certain types of people that just don't let you concentrate during exams. So let's just get to it and let's start talking about the first type of person that is the overly prepared student. And as we know, that person's always like in the library studying, always brings like seven pencils. They go beyond whatever they're assigned to do. And that's good. So definitely you guys keep it up. I have a lot. Three pens, one ruler, and two calculators because you never know. Now the second type of person that I really want to talk about is the loud person. You know, have those feelings when you're like actually like really concentrating, you're like, nee, 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 I can get this, and then you're like, this person just starts doing a very weird noise. And they just don't let me concentrate during my exam. I'm just like, shut up, shut up. Let me concentrate. Now the third type of person, and I feel like I have to separate this person from the second type of person, is the loud eater. I know this is an exam room, you tend to be like hungry because, you know, like it's like a three hour exam. Like I understand, I get hungry. Eat something that doesn't make a sound when you eat it and doesn't smell, especially if it smells. It's just, it makes it so much worse, but definitely just stop doing it. Jesus, man, be quiet. Now, the fourth type of person that I want to talk about today is the parasite. Usually, this person never goes to class and three days before your exam actually just texts you like, yo, man, do you mind if I just grab your notes and take some pictures? It's just that I, I don't know, they always make up an excuse like, yo, I never took notes or this happened to my notes, it's like whatever, you can take them. But like after that, they're like, oh man, like your notes are a little bit confusing, would you mind just like telling me what to do? It's like, no man, I gotta focus on my own exam, like you should, you should have gone to class. Stop doing that. Uh, now the fifth kind of person is what I call the speed racer, because they finish their exam so fast, like as soon as they get their exam, they just like get to it, like, like boom, like really fast, like they just like start jotting stuff down. Here you go, young man. There you go. Now the person number six is what I call the smooth talker because they can, you know, manipulate the professor and they use their words very nicely. Basically they ask for the answer without actually asking for it. Eventually they succeed and they like ace the whole thing. Excuse me. Hi professor. Hey, how may I help you? Sorry, I was, uh, you know, wondering uh, how's the wife? Uh, yeah, my wife is good. You see, I don't really understand the wording of the question. So like, if you could just tell me, you know, I'm not supposed to like give you the answer. Oh yeah, yeah, no, no, that's definitely not what I meant. Um, I was just wondering if you could, you know, just give me a hint here. Well, you know, like here, I was just asking, you know, about how like economics affect the world's okay. behavior. You know, I would take, um, you know, this guy. Okay. Uh, you know, I'm not, I'm not supposed to like tell you his name, but like, you know, his thank you. So that's everything I got for you guys today. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. And if you did, please don't forget to give it a big, big, big thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't yet. Definitely let me know in the comments down below if you could relate to the stuff that I just showed you. And I'll see you all in the next week's video. Bye.